this is my out on a limb thought. Uh, and I think Poles, while getting rid of his second round pick yesterday, has this on his mind as a way to replenish the second round pick. But my the big out on a limb pick is that the Bears get their their second round pick back from the Washington Commanders when they trade Justin Fields to Washington for their own second round pick. Hmm. That is that that is my prediction. My out on a limb prediction. But I do believe the the thought is is while they're in the in the market for the quarterback and I think they know and I believe they think they know already that Fields isn't their guy whether you like it or not whether you think that or not they know that and there is value for Justin and the value is probably a second round pick and like I said I value these second round picks and you don't want to go from these two first round picks to the third round without having a draft pick so how do you replenish it so you'll draft a quarterback and then whether it's Atlanta's second round pick, Atlanta will have a need. Didn't they just bench Ritter this weekend they too? Did. They um, did. And they've always been high on Fields. Uh, Fields had a great game against the Commanders. They'll have a new coach there, most likely. Maybe it's Beanie taking over the head coaching job. But wouldn't it be ironic if that's the right? If this is a form of irony, I don't know. But wouldn't it be something if the Bears would send Justin Fields to Washington? for their actual second-round pick in return. I don't think it's outrageous because if you play the scenario out and you believe that they have come to that conclusion, I don't, I'm don't. i not one that believes you draft a quarterback if you have the first, second, or third pick and you keep Justin in the fold. I think if you draft one of these quarterbacks that everyone is talking about, you will find a, a trade partner with somebody to, to move on from him and – it could be the Washington Commanders in your scenario. I don't think that's outrageous at all. So that's my out on that's a limb. That's connecting some dots. That, that's just that's a like a crazy out on a limb thought. But but I do believe that in the back of Poles' mind, he believes he's probably trading fields for a second. And I and I I think that's how they think they're gonna get a second round pick. Because polls, if you think about it. Since the days taken over, he had no first round pick in his first draft because of Ryan Pace. Right? They had they had no first round pick. Yes. They had um, they didn't draft till late. Would they have two? Was it two second rounders? I think the yeah. Third? They drafted Brisker, yeah. Gordon, and, Gordon yep. and, and, and then, then Bayless, Bayless. Jones in third. Yeah, and then last year they what did they end up trading? They traded the first their second. No, no, they had a first round pick. And then they traded their second round pick for Claypool. And then they had to wait till the Ravens pick in the second round. So they've never really had their full complement of picks because they've usually traded one of them away. So now this year they'll go into the draft with two first round picks, but nothing in the second round. So I think you've got to replenish a second round pick somehow, some way. Maybe that's how they do it. I think so. I don't think it's outrageous. I'm not sure where they are on it, but if you made me guess right now, my guess would be that, like you laid out in your hypothetical, that they've probably leaned in that direction pretty hard. Do you think Justin still secures a second-round pick? That's a good question as well. I do. I I think someone will give you a second-round pick for Justin. He is like – think about what uh, Cutler was in Denver. Yeah. Cutler was coming off a pro ball performance – But he had flaws because he threw interceptions. He was 26 years old. Um, He was the, what was he, the 11th overall pick in the draft? He was still on his rookie deal. Justin will still have two years of control. Mm -hmm. He still has done some good things, and someone will believe, and I still think that he can be a good quarterback in this league, that he was mismanaged and that he just needs to be put in the right situation. I don't know what value will have on it, but I think that a quarterback and one that you feel you can get more out of than the previous staff will have a premium attached to him versus a player in another position. And my point is that, Zed, uh, Cutler, you gave up two first-round picks and a player for Jay Cutler. Uh, so to get a second-round pick 
for a guy like Justin Fields, who has already done some pretty good things, was on pace for some good numbers this year. Last year set the uh, or close to a, a run a rushing record. Did he set the rush the Bears no, rushing yeah. record? Correct, second all time behind Lamar. Second all time. So I, I still think at his age, what he could still do, and with teams quarterback starved. I still believe you can get a second-round pick for him easily. 